Hi everyone, I'm Nicole from Really Good Stuff, here today to give you a bunch of fun and free Father's Day activities that you can do with your children, or you can send to your students' parents to do with their children, okay? So before I get started, I wanna do our giveaway. So I'm going to be giving away 10 prizes to um, lucky winners that enter, and all you have to do to enter is comment below with your biggest concerns or worries going into next school year. So it's really important for us to know more about what's going on in your lives. I know every state is different. So just comment away, tell us everything that you're worried about, any concerns you have, um, and hopefully we can be a solution for you with those concerns. So comment as many times as you like. The more you comment, the better your chances are of winning. Okay, so let me show you our first, um, our first thing here, which is our Happy Father's day sign okay so this is free we have it on our website um, under our free reproducibles but i will actually attach the link to this video so it's easier for you just to click it and you can print out um, these letters so if you're going to do this though it's important for you to know that these pen reproducibles actually have the whole alphabet in uppercase and lowercase letters so you have to pick out the letters you need to make the sign um, do not print every letter out or print out the whole thing because you will get over 50 pages, okay? So it's really important you only print out the pages you need to make the sign. The next thing I wanna show you is, this is pretty close to being free. Um, all you have to have in your home is, of course, a computer to print out a message and paper for background, and um, you'll have to take some pictures of your child. So using these pennants, you would give them the uppercase D to take two pictures with and an uppercase A to take one picture with so that you can make this say dad. And then you can have your child type up a little message to them or write down a message on a piece of paper. Either way, um, it's such a simple and inexpensive thing to do, but so meaningful and um, I think any father would love to receive this gift. Okay, now I'm gonna skip over to this side here because these are more free reproducibles that you can use. Um, I'm gonna show you just one of the pages. So we have these free coupons for um, to give for Father's Day, okay? So I'll show you I'll show you up close. So you can take a look at what they look like. So it's fun because your child will get to decorate them special for their father um, or for their fatherly figure, and then they can give them a whole bunch of coupons as a gift, okay? So as you can see, there are twelve here. Um, there's even one that they can come up with their own coupon down here. Um, so that's another one that I will attach the link to this video so that you can easily click on it, print it out, have your kids decorate, cut, and give it as a gift, okay? The next item, so this mason jar I have, I actually used for two different things. So a mason jar you can probably get from the dollar store. Um, they're very inexpensive. And what I did was I made an ornament. So what you do to make this ornament is cut out a piece of paper that will fit in the center, have your child decorate it, write Happy Father's Day, maybe draw a picture of them with their dad. Um, and then all you do is stick it in there. It actually pops in really nicely, um, or you can glue it or tape it, and then attach a piece of ribbon to the back. And it's a cute little hanging ornament that they can hang in their home. Um, really meaningful and really simple. Okay, the next item. So these kind of go together. You can do it two different ways. So this has to do with um, creating these sticks. So all you need is popsicle sticks and some kind of container. So I used um, this flower pot because I like that you can decorate it and write whatever you want on it. And it actually says on this side, if I could pick any dad in the world, I'd pick you. And then on the sticks, your child can write down um, different reasons that they love their dad or reasons that they would pick them. Um, however you wanna do it. With the mason jar, I would write something like reasons I love my dad and then have them write them all those reasons down on the sticks, okay? So all of these activities, like I said, are either free or very inexpensive. So I hope you get some use out of this. Um, and I want to mention one more thing, moving forward starting next week, Angela will be having videos um, show on Tuesdays and I will be on Thursdays. So we'll be doing videos, um, the two of us will be doing them twice a week starting next week. So please tune in, we'd love to see you. I hope you found this um, useful and helpful and I will see you next time. Thanks everyone.